Blesse mon cœur d'une langueur monotone. Je répète. Blesse mon cœur d'une langueur monotone. Hey everybody, Dutch Sense here. 1.02 a.m. Central Time on Sunday, August 4th, 2013. And I'm over here on my YouTube page, guys. Um, they were deleted my YouTube page tonight. I was in perfect standing, no strikes on my account, no community guidelines violations. You're supposed to get three before your account gets turned off, and my account just got shut down. This account has been terminated due to repeated or severe violations of our community guidelines. Right, and you click on these, and that just takes you to the information. That's it. Let you know about it. Let's go back. Information only. Let's go to my inbox. Okay, and this goes back July 24th, July 23rd, July 22nd. Okay, nothing in there. Here's a video service notification here at 12.16 a.m. So 45 minutes ago, they sent this. It says, Dutch Sense, your video, Huntsville Radar Mystery, BAE Systems, Decibel Research, and Raytheon, is flagged as inappropriate. Once a video is flagged, it's reviewed by the YouTube team. It's me going over a radar signal and showing that beneath it is Decibel Research Incorporated. Now, this is falsely flagged by suspicious observers and their viewers. They came over and flagged all my videos. They led a huge campaign. They had it up on Suspicious Observers page. Now, guys, I've got some news about suspicious observers. Today, he acknowledged that I did not threaten him or his family. He said it was a YouTube channel named The Benjamin Davidson that did it, and that he says that I run the channel, you see. Well, I'm here to tell you, I don't run a channel called The Benjamin Davidson, and we looked it up, and Benjamin Davidson's around back in May, three months ago, given suspicious observers a hard time. So three months ago, somebody else apparently knows or knew who Suspicious Observers was. I sent him an email letting him know that I know who he is. That was it. It's up on Facebook. You don't believe me? You can go look. Okay? You don't have to trust me on this at all. I posted the message on Facebook. Let me take you over to my Dutch Sense Facebook page. The link will be posted down below for this so you can go see it yourself. I redacted the names. I redacted the websites out of it. It's under my photos. Okay, click on photos. You guys can do this yourself, but the link to the photo will be down below. Here is the message. I did not threaten his family. I didn't threaten anybody. I said, I know who you are. And the reason that's important is because he harassed me for two years, accused me of fraud and other things, and I did not threaten his family. He tied his LLC, the company he started for YouTube, K-A-H-B LLC, you're not going to believe who owns these things, guys. Hollywood's involved. The movie Boy Toy 2011's involved. His family is involved in Hollywood. Oh, yeah. Oh, we're going to provide all the links on this. His sister's a Hollywood actress. His dad's a Hollywood movie producer producing 2011 Boy Toy, the movie. His sister starred in the movie. You can go look at his My Life profile. Let's just go ahead and look at a couple of these things while I got you on here. Okay? You know, you can go look up Benjamin Davidson from Pickering, Ohio. Here he is, born in 84. This is all stuff he put out. He put this stuff out related to Kalen Davidson, who's 26. Kalen Davidson starred in Boy Toy. Boy Toy was produced by his dad. Don't believe me? Go look it up. Charles E. Davidson. Here's all the companies he owns. Here's KAHB. When you give a donation to suspicious observers, it goes to KAHB LLC. As a matter of fact, let's just go over and do that. Let's go over and look at suspicious observers PayPal really quick here since they terminated my channel. Oh look, top search on YouTube. Okay, here we go. And let's just go to his most recent video from yesterday. And, oh, wanna donate a membership? Click here, go to our PayPal. We're going to his PayPal here, and it goes to KAHB LLC, Suspicious Observers. Turns out, Suspicious Observers trademarked the inf his name Actually, it was his dad who trademarked his name. His dad owns all of these media companies. His dad's associated with uh, Davidson Levine Film. Levine Davidson, right here, okay? Um, Levine Davidson Film and Production, LLC. 
Turns out this guy runs a whole bunch of media companies, not just one. Let's go look. Charles E. Davidson from Florida at the 1600 address at Clearwater where Suspicious Observer's trademark is registered to is registered. They also, Justin Senoplex, DFB Management, Levine Davidson Film and Production, these are all current. And then look at all the inactive ones, the ones they've done in the past. But they've got DFB Management, Healthcare Management, okay? Now a lot of these, you know, they're all going to the same address. What are the chances? So, you know, suspicious observers, when you are collecting donations, uh, look where it's going, guys. Okay? KAHB is going to Charles Davidson, who's doing this Hollywood stuff. Um, boy toy. There we go. Okay, here it goes. Produced 2011 Levine Davidson film and production, Boy Toy. Now you can go look at who starred in Boy Toy. Okay? Now here's the movie. Look at the budgets on this, guys. This is the company that is owning Suspicious Observer's trademark name. This is his parents. His parents produce movies in Hollywood. IMDB, his sister stars in it. Let's go look at that. Okay, so his sister's a Hollywood actress. His dad's a Hollywood producer. The company they have is his dad's, and the money you're donating goes to that. So, Suspicious Observers, if you guys are going to go around falsely flagging people's accounts, I had 700 more more videos actually more than 700 videos three hard years worth of work you guys flag my videos inappropriately saying they're inappropriate it's a radar video it's a radar video you guys are out of control you're an out of control mob i did not threaten suspicious observers you can go read the message like i said on facebook he has since acknowledged that okay he has since acknowledged that um, you guys can go ahead and see Tattoot's video on that since they've deleted my page. At Tattoot1009 Reloaded, I'll go ahead and put a link down below to that. And here it is, okay? Suspicious Observers admits that we did not threaten him. Here's his comment. You guys can go check that out. Um, he says, he didn't threaten me. He threatened to expose my family and I and our address if I didn't do it to myself. The message he shows does not reveal that explicit threat, but he made it for weeks along with a troll channel called the Benjamin Davidson. And again, that's not true. I don't run the Benjamin Davidson channel. Here's my comment down below. Got a bunch of thumbs up. I'm not associated with any other channels. I don't have a channel called the Benjamin Davidson. And it turns out we looked up Benjamin Davidson channel. It's been around since May. Okay? So suspicious observers, you suck. You're censoring information. Your group is an out-of-control mob with pitchforks trying to seek whoever it is that you're sicking them after. And you're not concerned with the truth. You don't know shit about what you're talking about, Harp. You have no clue. You think radar produces VLF and other weird things that are not accurate. It's a sad day when Dutch Sense is correcting somebody on radar, but there you go. Okay, you don't know anything about what you're talking about. Harp is not shut down. It's a fake story that you created. Back in May, we busted that wide open, and they repeated it. Now in July, the ARRL repeated that stupid-ass story that you created back in May. Suspicious observers, you're a liar. Weather modification is not beneficial for us. Uh, it, you say it is. It's not. Okay? Um, you're a corporate yes-man, and your family's involved with Hollywood. Go screw yourself. And all the suspicious observers, you guys are freaking sheeple. And half of them are paid for anyways robots. Really. No joke. I showed what you guys can pay for that. It's paid for. YouTube, this is the last time. I can't appeal this. I want to show you guys. Let's just go to my email really quick. Look, hear that? Can't click it. Can't click it. Can't appeal it. You can't even move your mouse over it to see an address. Can't right click it. Look, right click. Let's go to the inspect element. What do you know? Look, you don't have to take my word for it. There's no link here anywhere. Same here. Okay? So I got screwed royally. This is a radar video. Suspicious Observer sucks. I'm going to see what I can do about uh, obtaining legal representation at this point to go after the company that's been harassing me. This is a, a, he's actually using a Hollywood company to do this stuff. Um, he put out false accusations, libel, hearsay. I mean, I, you know, what do you want to call it? Slander. Um, he definitely has done that, saying I threatened his family. I did not. And you guys, I don't know how you can't allow this. I've been run off YouTube. All my videos are gone. I put three years of hard work in here. I proved everything I showed, all the radar videos, all the tornado videos, everything. I'll tell you what, 
you guys have fallen for a lie with him. And very few people came to my defense on this, by the way. Shame. Shame on this. Shame on all y'all for doing that. Especially suspicious observers and his stupid Hollywood connections. God, you think he'd tell you about that, right? 